Yeah. Yeah. No, nah, I can make it, bro. Alright. Hey, wake up. We're already here. Get off the car already. I don't have time for this shit. Sleep in class, okay. very um, isolated. I don't see her getting along with anybody, and she's by herself a lot. And I, I seen her in the hall, and I went to go ask her if everything was okay since she was falling asleep in class. Mm -hmm. And she jumped as soon as I touched her, and I felt really bad because I felt like maybe I shouldn't have touched mm -hmm. her. When and that's I, not very like her. You're saying this not, is something new. Yeah, it's it's come up. I I know her parents split up before. Oh, okay. um, it was just happened in the last year, and I know she's been living with her father. Do you have communication with her parents? Not very much. Okay. I mean, the other day I did notice her dad dropping her off at school, and I happened to be outside in the yard, and he was yelling at her, and basically almost kicked her out of the car. It was okay, very sad to see. She had definitely no jacket Definitely concern. On. In this weather, no jacket? Yeah, and so I, I offered her my, my scarf and just... I don't know, I feel like something's up and I don't know how to really go about it and I was hoping maybe if you could talk to her. I, I feel like she's in need of support right okay, now. Okay, so more support than from the teacher. For sure, that's definitely a lot of concern that you're bringing to my attention. So I'll definitely have a conversation with you. Is she with you all day? I can come maybe she tomorrow is. and have a talk with her. Yes, for sure. And see what's up whenever you need to. Perfect, so I'll definitely do that tomorrow. Bring her into my office, see if there's awesome. anything going on. Okay, okay thanks so thank much. You. I'll see you. see you. Uh, do you want a drink or anything? No? Okay, so uh, how are you doing today? Fine. Yeah, you're good? Did you have enough to eat today? You don't want anything, you're sure? Okay, sounds good. So your teacher, Miss Lopez, uh, brought up some issues to me about you falling asleep in class and wearing the same clothes. So I just want to bring this to your attention. Like, is everything all right at home? Yeah, are you sure? Like, the not sleeping, the not talking to your peers, this is all really weird and new for you. 
you're usually very interactive and outgoing, so has like the divorce maybe affected you? No, you're right, are you sure everything's at home? Okay, well I saw something on your neck which was a little bit concerning. Is there any more? Do you want to show me anything else? Okay, so because you showed me this, I really need to know what's going on at home and who this is. Um, it's my dad. He's been really angry and upset, I think, since my mom's gone. And he's taking it out on me a lot. Okay, okay. and so with all these bruises and everything, I know we've talked in the past about confidentiality, but because you are at risk of harm, Lindsay, I need to phone the police and let them know that this is happening. I'm sorry, but I need no, to. No, please don't. I'm sorry, Lindsay, but I, I don't need want to. That. I, there's no other choice. I'm very sorry, but I need to make sure that you're safe. Hi there, this is Diana Mendez calling from Centennial Public School. I just wanted to request an officer come down to my office. I just had a student by the name of Emma Smith, and she disclosed to me that her father has been hitting her. There's evident bruises on her arm and on her neck and on her torso. So she just left my office in a panic, so I'm just wondering how quickly one of your officers can get down here. Perfect, okay, thank you, I'll see you soon. Oh, hi, officer. Miss Mendez? Yeah, so I just called you about Emma. She ran away in a crisis, so we really need to go look for her right now. All right, let's go. All right. This is Officer Fareed. He's going to have a little conversation with you, okay? Hi, Emma. I'm Officer Fareed. Um, I was told by Ms. Mendez that there has been some sort of disturbance with your father and you. Can yeah. you please tell me what happened? Um, it's just what I told Ms. Mendez. He's been hitting me. Yeah, just lots of bruises. Oh! Hey, what the hell is going on? Hey, come with me. Uh, sir. Sir, please step aside. We're Why are you even here? here? She's sir, my daughter. Please. I want to take her home. So right? we're, gonna need, we're gonna need backup. We're gonna need backup, sir. Okay. Please, we're gonna call you. Need to, uh, step Did aside. you call her? Sir, I called. I need called. To step aside. She's gonna talk okay? to her. Are you okay? Why? Sir. It's okay. Hey, sure. officer, what's going on? Sir, sure, I didn't, I didn't want to use this. No, what? Back up. Um, we had concerns about your daughter. We heard that you're beating her. Is this true? No, it's bullshit. What's she telling you? Do you even listen to that crap? Yeah. We really need. We really need another backup. Why do you even need a backup? I need to take her home. That's it. Sir, please step back. Okay. Uh, uh, uh.